Alrighty, that's another session done and dusted. Ended up being a pretty good little session. Um, had the GoPro run the whole time, and that's the plan this year is to film more, get my YouTube back up and running, and post more videos on the socials. Uh, one thing that I haven't been doing though is I haven't been filming intros and stuff like that. So what I might do is I've been using the swim crab a lot. I might chuck together a little compilation of all the swim crab footage, um, and this will be the intro for that video. So. I'll keep doing it, I'll keep filming. Hopefully I'll get better at it. And um, yeah, let us know your honest feedback. Um, I'm cruising home now, so I'll get home, clean the boat and kick the feet up in this footage. So let us know what you think and I'll keep going. Was that a finger mark? Yeah. Yeah, it's a finger mark. Oh, he's good too. So, what well, would have been a really nice nursery of a finger. Got eaten at the boat. What do you do? He's definitely bigger than my last one. I'm not sure how big he would have been, but you know, he would have been a good solid fish on the swim crab. cover for the bait and the um and the bigger fish i suppose so yep there's all oh that's good fish that's a jimmy yeah that's a jimmy there's a few sharks in this area so um always go a little bit harder on them can't run super heavy um heavy gear on them because you won't get bite but yeah, you definitely have to bite them a little bit harder this is definitely a jimmy For area, that's um, that's a really nice fish. Um, not a giant, 
um, in the terms of Jewfish, but it's all about where you're fishing and, and what's available. But that's a really nice fish. I'm, I'm super happy with that one. A slow morning, but gone to a nice little flatty two inch swim crab. We're catching a surprisingly a lot of flatted on the swim crab, they must eat them a fair bit. That's very cool, very happy with that one. That's one thing I really like about the swim crab, you're showing them something compelling completely different so they might be they might be on a prawn bite having a good run of prawns in the river but they've been seeing and eating prawns the whole time get these one flatty the amount of flatty we're getting on the crab is incredible only a little fella but he's fully swallowed it again like I was saying with Showing the fish something different, this flathead, you might have only seen a couple of crabs today and it it's just it can be showing the fish that point of difference. I'll show you how deep he's taken this. Oh he just bit me off. So I don't know whether you'll be able to see this. Oh, he's definitely gonna spike me this fella. But that crab's still in there. He's bitten me off when he got in the boat. That swim crab is so deep in there. Like I was saying, it's showing the fish, showing the fish that point of difference. Where he might have been looking at prawns all day, he might have he might have a full tummy, and then a slow little crab swims past, and he's not going to say no. A little little bit of delicacy for him. So that's him there. Two inch shrimp crab, nice little flatty. Getting back. Would have had a good feed today if we were keeping them, but yeah, get them back. So I'll retie that leader and see if I can get into a dewy. Yeah, they're cool. Yeah. Yep. Well, drift. Look at that school. It'll be interesting to know what they are. Feels like a trev. Oh, big bloody. Definitely not them ones. Yeah, good chewing. Nice little flatty on the um, on the new two inch swim crab, white spot. Nice little one. That's on the new two inch swim crab in white spot. Little flatty, getting back. Ate it amongst the school of dewey, so get back in there and try and get a dewey. Getting a lot of jacks on them. 
big part of their diet is crabs. A lot of the ones are coughing up crabs that we catch on these um, on these rocks. So yeah, cool to see him come out when we're chasing dewies. Very nice GT on the new Fiddler Crab. Very happy with that one. Getting back in the water. Very nice fish. Worked very hard for him today. Finally got that clunk and got it done. New two inch from crab on a quarter inch jig head. Very, very happy. I've got a really big school of Jew, Taylor and Trevelyans and everything here on some um, deep sort of rubble and um, the new two inch swim crab on a quarter ounce head run out tired. Um, I'm spot locked and just casting diagonally up and bringing it across these rocks. Um, so the idea is just to hit the bottom and then a couple of hops up. Um, I'm targeting the deweys and the, and the trevs and the tailor keeps snatching them but definitely not complaining about catching fish. Oh, yeah, there's one. 
I think that's a, I think that's a tie lot. Nice GT. Nice GT on the new two inch string crab. Quarter ounce head. Pinned him nicely. These guys keep belting it while I'm trying to fish for the dewies, but like I said, I'm not going to complain about catching fish at all. Pinned him well. Oh my quarter ounce. Oh. Definitely no complaints there. So he's good for another fish. Let's chuck him back on the jig head. Let's see if we can get a dewy out of him. So what I'm doing now is I stopped getting a few bites. Took spot lock off and I'll just drift back. Drift back 20 meters or so and then see if I get a bite and then I'll spot lock again. Um, those fish stop showing up on the sound. Where is yeah, there's one. Oh. Feels a bit bigger. That's what can be handy about just moving around a little bit. When you stop getting bites. It feels like a heavier fish, this could be a better dewy. Hasn't woken up yet. Yeah, it feels very heavy. It might be foul hooked. I'm not sure. Foul Trevelli, maybe? Not a Dewey. Oh, it fell trip. Can't bloody pull him up. <laughs> Come on, mate. No, he's not fell. He's fighting weird. Better fish, though. Pull him in. He's a better fish. There's a couple of jewies on the sound in there, too. Nice GT, probably like 42, 43 or something. Yeah, I've got a measure here, I'll check. Yeah, about 40. All right, no bite that time, so I'll do a drift. So what I'll do is the current's coming this way, I'll do a cast back and drift onto it. And once, my, once the boat gets in line with my cast, I'll wind back in, so back cast here, and then I'll push against the wind, so the boat doesn't drift away from where I cast it because I won't hit the bottom if that happens. So I'll just drive against the wind here and towards my lure. It'll make contact a lot easier. There we are. Few fish are showing up over here, so I'm about to run my lure through them. Looks like a mix of Dewey's and Trevally, which is what I've been kind of finding today. Sounds it tripped into that school. That was a Trevally bite, though, that wasn't a Dewey. I wind that in. I think he pants me. He pants the crab. Um, Always try and keep you in your head where that school was. They can move, but put a little back cast onto them here. They should start showing up on the other side of the sand and now we're turning. Yes, a few of them didn't pick them up as good that time. Yep. Oh, yeah, hand off the reel. Yep, there's one. Feels like another trap. He's 
one of these treads is quite different today. It's real weird. It's real hard to pick what you're doing. <laughs> Starting to do the thumps now, but these are still sharp little runs. Ooh. Right up, mate. I'm just going a bit hard on these fish as well because there is sharks around this spot. So I'm running a 15 pound leader. I'm missing the sea stuff. It's really good. Can't bolt it. Right. Little pole, another nice trev. So there he is there. Another nice 40 odd centimetre fish. You know how I said there was sharks? I don't know whether you'll see this on the GoPro. But there's a shark coming through on the sounder there. And possibly one there, but there, there's definitely one there. A couple of dewies, all with a nice school coming through. Of Crivelli. So we'll um, try and get to them. that bite that was a real subtle eat on the bottom Oh, big Taylor. Really big Taylor. Because I don't have the net ready. <laughs> hey, look at that. How cool is that? Not bad. Not bad at all. 